Hey guys, I'm Christopher Hill, your realtor in Dallas, Fort Worth, and today we're touring the Lockhart 2 by Coventry Homes, a almost 3,800 square foot, five bed, four bath in South Point. If you've never been with this builder before, they are known for their quality and excellent touches. Don't take my word for it. Let's step inside. Now the first thing you can see is this entryway here. We're going to go straight into the office. It's right around the corner. Got that built-in shelving, nice big open windows, lots of natural light. Beautiful French doors to get in. This is the dining space. We'll just quick cut around this table here. You can see the stairwell there that winds up. And we'll cut past the dining area here into this little butler's pantry area. They've got some wine storage for you. And then the big pantry, lots of space. And this open concept kitchen at double oven and a built-in microwave, lots of modern cabinetry, gas range, farm sink, dishwasher. Winding around there, here's the breakfast nook and the view from that into that beautiful space there. Catch a glimpse of that back porch. It's a really nice area. And then we have this huge family area with the high high vaulted ceilings that you can see it's open to the second floor they've got that little winding stair accent piece just so much space in this place there's the kitchen again it's your tv area electric fireplace we're coming around the corner here Whipping into the master suite. Tease that master bath. Here is the master bedroom. Now they've got this bowed out uh, five panel, just tons of natural light window. That's an optional feature, not a big upgrade. Definitely worth it. Beautiful space. We'll wind around here and take a peek at this master bath now. Got the dual vanities, lots of cabinetry. Dual mirrors. Big soaker tub. Lots of nice paneled finishes. And then you got a see-through into that shower space. And it is a big shower. The toilet tucked away there, as it should be, behind a door. <laughs> this big glass shower with a bench seat. Lovely. Here is your massive walk-in closet. It's just one, but it is big. Lots of space. Winding around straight into the laundry room, which is great for a master suite. Good design there. Not surprising with this builder. We'll cut into this side area. This would normally be your third car garage area. Um, looks like they could do it as a room and here they did it as a kind of a conference space. The panels in there. So that would normally be a garage. They can finish it out nice if you want them to. Winding around to the left here. Here is one of those additional bedrooms. This is a first floor one. I've got it done up nice with all this modern decor. Lots of good interior design in these. They stage them real nice. Got that French door closet, nice and big. Good natural light. Just looking around here. Take a peek in the closet. Yeah. They like to stick these little bags in the uh, Coventry Homes houses, house closets. Wind over. Now this is technically a guest bath, um, but they've got a shower in it. You'll see that in a second here. 
Nice big modern glass shower. Very well done. So that's wonderful for your guests. And I guess that downstairs room would be your guest room. Should you be so inclined. Put all the kiddos upstairs. We're gonna cut to the front there. Take a glance up that winding staircase from the bottom. And I'll uh, speed through the going up the stairs, wind around and give you guys a good shot what this looks like upstairs there. Very nice. Very nice. We'll kind of do a pivot here, let you see the whole space. This is the game room. We'll kind of wind back here, let you get another view of that staircase area if you were sitting up here. And they've got that bump out in the ceiling. Get a view at these wonderful windows with the gorgeous natural lighting. This is what an affordable luxury home should be. Got a little step up there. Here is your powder room off of both that game and media room. Um, just a half bath, basically. We'll come into this big media room. They've got it uh, step-down seating, which is nice. We do it up as a theatrical space or just a TV room. Lots of space. Very well done. Feels like a theater. Wind out here quick and get back onto this balcony overlay area. Got this built in desk thing. So, kind of a pivot office space. I'm sure, you can tell them to leave that out. Here is one of the many bedrooms on this floor. Nice decor. Wind around here. Decent natural light. Not fantastic, but pretty good. I'll wind through here. Here's a decent sized walk in closet. There's that attic access for you. Extra storage yeah, up in your roof. I'll wind out. This is gonna be, we'll skip that bedroom for a second. I'll come into this one. This is an optional bedroom add on you can get if you want even more space and this bedroom comes with its own bath which is nice so looking through this space it's a full bath and then the closet pivots off of that it's a little bit smaller but there's one of those gift bags swing back around here back out and we'll check out some of these other bedrooms. Popping in here. Very nice. What, what you'd expect. Uh, they do have these uh, bump out window options there. You see that on the left and behind me. There it is. See out there. there got more homes going up cut in here and they've got this kind of Jack and Jill bathroom space there. There's your walk-in closet. Another bag. And then here's the Jack and Jill bath proper. Full tub, shower. the other side powder room. You'll see each side gets their own little towel closet, which is nice. So if you've got teenage girls, each one gets their own space to get ready. And we'll pop over here and take a look over this, uh, this banister here on that space below. It's just a really cool dynamic area. So that's pretty much the tour. I hope you guys enjoyed, and thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed the tour, please take a second and at least leave me a like. I really appreciate it. It helps me out. It helps other people find the video. 
And yeah, subscribe if you want to subscribe and leave a comment if you want to reach out. So those of y'all that are still here, I'd like to take a second and uh, talk about someone very important to me. And that would be uh, my Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. I appreciate that you're still here and I figured, hey, if you're here, I'll share some good news with you, which is that God loves you. He actually loves all of us uh, to the extent that he sent his son to die so that we could be reunited with him. Uh, Jesus chose willingly to take the punishment we deserve for our disobedience. And if we accept that gift, then we are forgiven. If you're curious and would like to know more about that, feel free to find the Bible and read Romans and you'll find all you need. And I've been Christopher Hill. Thanks for watching. Have a blessed day.